Let's talk about Orico Thunderbolt to 10 gigabit Ethernet networking adapter, which I think is a great alternative to the few brands that are out there at an amazing price point. I've been testing this, so let's find out what I think about it. I'm Aris Wright. Full disclosure, Orico sent me this to do review. All the opinions you're about to hear are going to be my own. This is their REA-10. It is a Thunderbolt on one end and to a 10 gigabit ethernet networking adapter. This is really cool for computers that does not have 10 gigabit networking capability. If you want the high speed, but for instance, you have a laptop and this applied to both Mac and PC, this is a great device for that. Now for your desktop, it really just depends. If you have like a Mac Studio, it already comes with 10 gigabit networking built in so you don't have to worry there but if you have for example the current generation mac mini or even the previous generation one and you did not configure that with 10 gigabit ethernet networking well this is a great and compelling option for that this will also span the gamut from macbook air all the way to macbook pro 16 inch and like i said it will also work for pc laptop and everything too the nice thing about it in my testing of this is it doesn't require any extra driver you plug it in it is bus power so on one end it is pretty much what they call like pc in this is where you would use the included braided cable this is a usb4 braided cable plug it in plug the other end into the machine and on the other end it's just your standard ethernet connection port right there and even though you can't use sfp plus module with this i would say that these cables are fairly prevalent and you're probably going to have a much easier time trying to plug these in rather than trying in to find an SFP plus adapter to use with this anyway. It is all aluminum design and what Orico have done differently than their competitor too is to cool down the chipset. They have also built a new fan. In my testing, the fan is not loud. It doesn't create like a high pitch or anything. It's something that works out fairly well to keep the device cool and you do get the full speed from this. I mean, there's really not a lot to say about this other than it's a pretty good, nice, low, compact design that comes with everything built in that you need at a price point that's better than the alternatives that are out there market with stock that is available right now so i would highly look at this device if you're looking for a 10 gigabit networking adapter a few things i want to share on their website is that they do all those things it's portable but this will also work for any other computers and lastly one of the important things is that it will do 10 gigabit networking but also do 5 2.5 g and also the one gig too but the one gig is generally already built into your device unless you have a laptop but if you need to have hardwire i think this is a great adapter especially if you're not just looking to get hardwire now at a lower speed but in the future you might be upgrading i think these would be compelling options there are other brands that i've talked about on my channel that i purchased to test but i really think like this price point and in my usage of it, this is now my primary device that i use to link my macbook pro to my main nas and also my main mac studio in pretty much my office, my studio space that I have. So you can see that from the testing result there, downloading, uploading files from my MacBook Pro has been a breeze. We're getting full speed. We're getting pretty much the equivalent speed that we're getting from other Macs and also other networking adapter that I've used. So this is providing itself to be a really great solution. If you're looking for this, I'll leave a link to it in the description. If you have any questions or comment about this, please share them with me. Give this a like, subscribe, and hit the bell if you're new. I'm Art, and I thank you for your time.